Okay, I'm a little worried about this bad boy right here. Uh, might have wasted a pick getting this. There was nothing coming out of the product. Like, it just seems it's either dry or empty. Hello everyone, my name is Sandra and thank you so much for tuning in. All right, y'all, so for the first time, I think ever, my Ipsy, wait, it's upside down. My Ipsy glam bag and my Ipsy boxy charm came literally at the same time. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox these things together as one. Let's go for the glam bag first because you know, they're smaller sizes, we'll save the big stuff for last. Ooh, okay, this bag is cute. <laughs> It looked nice on the preview, but in person, this is so much cuter. Isn't that gorgeous? You see these? I'm about to get these. <laughs> I'm about to order them tonight. I'm so excited. They actually have another mystery bundle that's like $125 and you get 20 full-size items. I wanna get it, but I'm a little bit nervous cause I do not want Ipsy playing in my face and sending me 18 products instead of 20 or sending me 20 products, but a few of them are deluxe samples. I mean, I I'm, I'm still thinking about whether or not I wanna get that mystery bundle. I might just so that I could tell y'all if it's popping or if it's just or if it's just a scam. But y'all, let's go ahead and get into this bag first. Isn't that gorgeous? And I love that this is on the back. And then you get these little cute little bead thingies. I'm totally into it. Look at that, that's so pretty. I just, I don't get it. Like, how did they come up with all these different designs for these bags? Like, their design team must be on it, okay? This is probably one of my favorite ones that they've had. But y'all, let's go ahead and see what we got in the bag, okay? It feels a little, a little flat. It feels a little flat, so I'm a bit concerned, but we'll see. We'll see. The first thing that I'm pulling out is by Phase Zero and it is the Crown Powder Highlighter. And this is what the packaging is looking like. Super freaking itty bitty. I would put this in the giveaway, but I feel like I have so many highlighters in the giveaway. You know, I don't want to give someone just like a bunch of highlighters. So I will keep this one. Oh, it comes in like a cute little box like this. Like there's a box within a box. Isn't that adorable? Probably a waste of packaging, but very cute. Look how itty bitty this is. This is so itty bitty. I mean, it's a deluxe size. So of course it's gonna be itty bitty, but it's so itty bitty. Bro, look at how tiny that is. Teeny, teeny, tiny highlighter. Let's go ahead and see how she performs. Ooh. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That's very pretty. Okay, we starting off with some hits. Let's see what we got next. The next thing is by People beauty and this is the front liner mask and scrub Ooh, soothe and exfoliate with tri-molecular hyaluronic acid triple plant moisture complex and kaolin 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 i don't know but this is what it looks like the packaging is super adorable yeah this is just like a little uh exfoliant i have so many exfoliants right now it's ridiculous so we're gonna go ahead and put uh, bruh, I don't know what that was. It's like I wanted to say the words, but they just would not come out. We're gonna go ahead and put this in the future giveaway. So one of y'all will get this really cute little scrubby scrub. It's nice and safety sealed. So you know I ain't been in your stuff. Very cute, very cute. Off to the side for one of y'all. So this is the Lip Gloss Blissful by Ofra. Yeah, this is just like a little squeezy tube lip gloss. Ooh, okay. This looks like it has like a little bit of pigment to it. Oh, that's very interesting. This is what the lip gloss is looking like. I think that's pretty. I think that's really, really pretty. It has a nice sheen to it and a very nudey, browny kind of color with some shimmers. That's cute. We'll definitely give this one a try. Let's see. The next thing that I'm pulling out is by Belle and Ar Argent? Belle and Argent? I think that's how you say it. Something that's in the color Anika. What is this? It doesn't really say what, what this is. Yeah, it doesn't say what this is, so I'm gonna have to open her up and see. But let me get the safety seal off so you can really give her a good look up and down and see what she is. This is what it looks like. Very cute, very neutral looking. This is like a little eyeshadow stick thingy, which I haven't really used too many eyeshadow sticks. I just, I don't know. I just, I haven't really thought to reach for them. This is how much product you get, which really isn't that much. I guess this is like a travel size. Ooh, this actually goes perfect with the lip gloss. Look at that. I think that is so freaking cute. This must be travel size because there's no way that's full size. It's so tiny. 
too itty bitty to be full size. And the last thing that I'm pulling out is by Glow Recipe. And this is the Watermelon Glow PHA plus BHA Pore Tight Toner. Ooh, very cute and itty bitty. I actually like the things that I've gotten from Glow Recipe. I have their cleanser and it's been, it's been really nice. I got it in like a glossy box. I actually have two. I have two of the little itty bitty ones from a glossy box. So I'm very excited to try their toner. Ooh, and it's safety sealed. Okay, you know your girl loves a good safety seal. That definitely smells like watermelon. I'm gonna just pour like a little, little, little dr Ooh, it's thick. I was not expecting it to goop out. I was expecting it to like little water trickles, but that was like a goopy kind of serum texture, which is cool. It's, it leaves my hand feeling a little sticky. I'm not gonna lie. We'll see. We'll have to try this over the face. So I'm definitely gonna bust this out for, you know, my next nighttime skincare routine that you really shouldn't do because it's too much, but I'm gonna do it anyways because I'm filming. When I do one of those, I'm definitely gonna bust this out and see what she worked with on my face. But y'all, that was everything in my mystery, not mystery, this ain't no mystery. It's a mystery to y'all, but it wasn't no mystery. This was everything in my glam bag for March. Now, moving on to the real fun part, okay? The part that's real exciting is my boxy charm where we got our full size items. Oh, they double taped my, they didn't say just one piece of tape. They gave me double tape this time. This is what she's looking like when I open her up. Okay, we got our little stuff, got a little magazine. I feel like sometimes they give us pricing with the glam bag and then other times they don't. Like, Ipsy, I'm gonna need some consistency, okay? Cause last time y'all gave us prices and that was pretty cool. This time y'all just give us a thing that says a bunch of stuff we don't really care to know. I don't know, maybe I'm asking for too much. <laughs> Going into my little boxy charm. The first thing that I'm pulling out is by Kira Moon and it is the Flower Melon. They, it just repeats Flower Melon several times. Hyper, no, Super Hydra Serum. And this is what the box is looking like. Isn't that super freaking cute? I love that rainbow iridescent. That is beautiful. And it says, are you ready to glow? Of course I am. I love glowing, okay? It says, Flower Melon Super Hydra Serum is a three-in-one elixir that hydrates, smooths, and plumps the skin to perfection. Oh, look at that. Isn't that so cute? <laughs> I love that little heart on the top. That is fun. I love when packaging is fun. Isn't that adorable? It's like a little thingy thing like this. I think this is so cute. I don't even have anything on my face. Well, that means I could have tried the toner too on my face. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. We'll do a little quick little try on for this stuff. I'm gonna just try a little bit of the serum first. How you get the stuff out? Bruh, I shouldn't have to do all this. It's so thick that it's just not coming out. Okay, when I'm rubbing it on my face, it self sells. It smells more like watermelon. It's a nice little toner. She's cool. She can hang with the crew. Now let's get into this little serum. You can be like a little Instagram people because it has a nozzle like this. And then I guess you just, ooh, okay. And then I put a little dot right there. Well, it has like a flower scent, like an actual flower scent. It smells like you're in a bed of flowers. <laughs> Not roses, but flowers. You know, like those flowers that they have outside the school during spring? That's what that looks like. Or any public service building where they have flowers? That's what that smells like. Which isn't for everyone. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's cool. It left my face a little sticky. It's still not eaten. My Tony Moly Marine Serum, it's not eaten after that. But it's it's decent. So when I'm not using my Tony Moly, I would definitely bust out my Kira Moon. Moon, no, not Moonflower. Flower Melon. <laughs> Next is actually an add-on, and I'm a little sad about the size. I was thinking it was gonna be much bigger. This is the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. And I think this add-on was like $6. I was thinking that it was gonna be like a full size, but this is just a little itty bitty thing. If it was gonna be this tiny, they really should have just put it in the $3.50 section. Cause this even says not for resale. Like why are they selling me something that's not for resale? Ipsy. But yeah, this is just like a little cream. It says replenishing jack Japanese purple rice for dry skin. I think that purple is very cool. Like, this is so cute. Ooh, she thick. She looked thin in the in the pot, but she's thick, thick. Not as thick as like those butters that we got from JLo Beauty and Tula. Not as thick as them, but still relatively thick. And it doesn't really have too much of a scent to it. I'm not gonna lie, it feels really good. I just wish it was bigger for $6. If I had known it was gonna be this itty bitty for $6, I mean, I would've still bought it just cause I wanna try it. $6, I, I would have expected a bigger size. 
The next thing that I'm pulling out is by Iconic London, and this is the Tint and Texture Brow Perfecting Gel. This is what this looks like. And this is in the color Chestnut Brown. I don't even know if that's my color, bruh. But this is what she looks like. Very cute, okay? Matches that cute little highlighter duo that we got last time. Oh, I opened it upside down. I opened it upside down. It goes like this. You, you pull out the big part. This is what it looks like. Very itty bitty. Let's see what the color it looks like on this. Bruh, I'm not getting any color. Don't tell me this thing is dried out. Bruh. Okay, there's the little pigments, but it's barely there. What the hell is that? I was expecting this to like actually draw on. I might have to try it on my eyebrows. Maybe it's wanting to cling to hair. And because there's like not really any hair on my arm, it's not really showing up. I don't know, we'll see. I don't have the best track record with eyebrow gels. I more prefer a pencil or like the little cream where you use the brush to put it on. I prefer something like that as opposed to like a brow gel thingy like this. This, but I will try it and see if I like it. If I don't like it, then it just is what it is. I know in the future not to open or not to keep any brow products that are like this if it doesn't work right for me. The next thing is another add-on. Y'all, I got some more of my old lady cream, okay? Don't hate, don't hate the player, hate the game. I got some more of my old lady cream. We already know what she looks like. We already know that we stand her. 10 out of 10 for me, and this is full size. I paid like what, $16 instead of 98. So I came up, I should have got two, but I didn't want to be greedy. <laughs> I did not want to be greedy, so I only got one. And I'm still working through my other Elemis Marine Creams. So this is a good, this is a good steal. I'm gonna put this in my little box for later. And once I run out of my current old lady cream, I got a backup. This alone was a, a steal for the month. I just, I, I just feel uh, a little jealous of the ladies that got that as their power pick. Cause your box is already inflated by value. Cause that is already like half the value you're expected to see in your boxy charm. The next thing is in a beat up, slightly beat up box, but she okay. Okay, she made it here in this, in one piece. Box beat up, but she in one piece, I think. And this is by Defiance Beauty. Oh, I didn't even show y'all. I'm over here taking it out the box. I didn't even show y'all the box. This is what she looks like. Very cute. Okay, a little disheveled, but cute. Ooh, this feels fun. <laughs> So this looks like it's probably just like a little eyeliner pencil. Yeah, liquid eyeliner pencil. Isn't that packaging just so much fun? Instead of being like fully round, it's like kind of almost like a crystal. Okay, this is what the pen is looking like. A nice felt tip. Let's see how you draw though. What that line, ooh, look at that. And that went on like a dream. Okay, no tugging. I'm not seeing any little swoon. There's a little itty bitty spider vein kind of popping out, but it's so itty bitty you won't even notice it. So I, I, I like her, all right, I like her. And we will definitely be keeping the eyes in line with this bad boy right here, okay? This defiance for you see. She gonna keep the eyes in line. The next thing that I'm pulling out is another item by Glow Recipe. Okay, we, we recipe in with the glow this time around. And this is the Strawberry BHA Pore Smooth Blur Drops Serum. And it's a treatment and primer all in one. That box is so cute. <laughs> I love the little strawberries. I think that is adorable. Let's see, I wonder if this smells more strawberry than the uh, the toner. Cause the toner, I mean, it, it, it had a slight strawberry, not strawberry, watermelon. Wait, was I just comparing strawberry to watermelon? Let me rephrase. I hope it has a stronger scent close to what it says it is, right? So like this one's strawberry, I hope it smells more strawberry than this toner smelled like watermelon, if that makes sense. If it doesn't, then I don't know what to tell you. But this is what the packaging is looking like. This is super freaking adorable. I'm gonna try it on right now just to see if I wanna use it as a, a serum. Put a little, ooh, that really did come out like a glow drop. Let me put this back on before it spills everywhere. But this is what the texture consistency is looking like. We'll just put a little bit on our face and see, see if it gives us any blurring. I really don't smell any strawberry. <laughs> I don't smell a lip of strawberry. It actually doesn't seem to have a scent at all. I don't really see much of a difference. I mean, we'll try her as a primer and see how she holds up. If she makes our makeup look good or if her makeup peels away, we'll, we'll try that at a later time, okay? During the try on. And I think this is the last thing that's in my little box right here. The last thing is actually a eyeshadow palette. Well, a, I mean, an. 
<laughs> you know, English language and eyeshadow palette. And this is by Wander Beauty and it is the Trailblazer eyeshadow palette. Now this is very, very cool. I love the outside packaging, very sleek. Okay, and she comes nice and safety sealed. I actually really like the palettes that I've gotten from Wander Beauty. Like that seascape is so cute. So I, I, I like Wander Beauty. And this is what the inside packaging is looking like. Very simple, very sleek. Let's see what these shadows is looking like. Ooh, okay, that's pretty. So it comes with a little mirror. And then this is your color story. I think that is so pretty. We're definitely gonna do some swatches and see what these shadows are looking like on my skin. I think that is a very pretty color story. I love these greens. I'm gonna be all over in this section. I'm definitely gonna play with these greens because I mean, it's March. St. Patrick's, you gotta play with the greens. If you don't, then what are you doing? Let's go ahead and do some swatches and see how the shadows perform. All right, so let me bring y'all in so you can see these swatches. Bruh, get into it. Those greens are absolutely gorgeous. This one on my wrist just makes me look ashy. You can barely see it, but I just, I look ashy in person. So I don't know if we like her yet. Maybe she'll be like a little, I don't know, transition shade. And then, I, I don't know, we'll find a use for her. All right, y'all, and that was everything in my Ipsy and BoxyCharm for March. I think this is okay. I'm a little worried. Okay, I'm a little worried about this bad boy right here. Uh, Might have wasted a pit getting this. There was nothing coming out of the products. Like it just seems to be either dry or empty. But other than that, everything else was pretty nice. And we got so much makeup in here that we could literally do an entire look. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Febe. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces. Thank you.